Hello, and thank you for joining us here at Tesco. Today, we will be showing you how to operate your Braun wheelchair lift on your vehicle. Remember that this video is not intended to take the place of your vehicle's owner's manual. Tesco Bus Corporation and Tesco Specialty Vehicles are not responsible for any damage or injuries incurred from the improper use and operation of vehicles or equipment. This video is for informational purposes only. The first step to enable operation of the lift is to make sure that your vehicle is running and to engage the vehicle's parking brake. Now our parking brake is enabled. Depending on your vehicle, you may have a power button or switch to enable the wheelchair lift's interlock system. If you haven't already, make sure that this button or switch is set to on. Next, you'll want to gain access to the lift by locating and opening the doors. Now that we have access to the lift, find the power switch that will typically be located at the bottom left or right hand side of the lift and make sure that it is flipped to the on position. Once the lights at the top corners of the lift are illuminated, you'll know that the lift has power and is ready for use. To operate, locate the lift's remote, which looks a lot like the one shown here. It'll be mounted to the front or near the side of the lift. Before deploying the wheelchair lift, make sure that the surrounding area is clear and that the vehicle is on level ground. It is important to make sure all body parts and objects stay clear away from the lift during operation as to not obstruct its movement and to avoid damage or injury. First, you will want to hold down the unfold button to bring the lift down from its upright position. Once unfolded, hold the down button to then lower the lift to the ground, allowing easy access to roll onto the lift. When loading passengers or items onto the lift, make sure that everything is properly secured. A great way is by making use of the safety belt and buckle. And of course, be sure to refer to manufacturer guidelines for more information. When you're ready to raise the lift, hold the up button to bring the platform back up until it stops and the back ramp comes down, allowing access into the vehicle. Then when the platform is clear, Hold the Fold button to bring the lift back to its upright position. Once it's folded back up, put the remote back, flip the power switch to off, as well as any other wheelchair power switch, close your doors, and release your parking brake before getting back on the road. Note that there are a few features for safety built into the lift to minimize any potential dangers. Your outboard and inboard barriers are short metal flaps on either side of the lift platform, as sort of small ramps or transitions from the lift. However, they are also wired with switches and sensors that when disturbed will disable lift operation to prevent damage or injuries. These barriers must be completely folded up for lift movement and only unfold when reaching the end of its full movement, making sure that whatever is on the lift stays on and stays safe. The metal plate leading inside is also pressure and weight sensitive, making sure the lift is clear before operation and movement. Both lift arms on either side also feature sensors to ensure the lift is fully down or folded up completely. The doors also have sensors to determine whether they are opened or closed. Using the interlock system to disable the ability to release your parking brake and drive away. If you have trouble operating or enabling the lift, it is worth checking these features to troubleshoot if proper procedures described earlier are followed. And that is how to use your vehicle's Braun wheelchair lift. For all of your transportation and mobility needs, choose Tesco for over 50 years of our proven quality and trusted name. Call, click, or visit today. Thanks for watching.